winner oh. of this tournament does get a free ride to cost. I, cost. I am excited. Uh, we both we have pretty Zenodo pretty much confirmed, Dark Wizzy confirmed, and we have a lot of interest from other top players and and other regional top players as well. Oh, why are you running away? Where are you running? I don't know. Nine Waters finally shows up, and now Castelia runs away. I well, am. I, I guess he is DDD, so all he's going to be doing this entire time is running away. But yeah, watch him come back with a spike ball. <laughs> It's good luck. Yeah, it, it definitely is good luck. Uh, I do I do remember, though, uh, iModders actually had to play Perp earlier in this event. And uh, he kind of uh, yeah, took Fal Perp's DDD out behind the barn, if you know what I mean. It yeah, was yeah, it was yeah, not Fal a pretty Falco sight. Falco just reflected everything DDD was throwing out. It was actually kind of funny. This is a hard matchup. But Perp, primarily a snake player these days, uh, doesn't have as much as much DDD in, in his blood recently, but let's see what a full-blown DDD main regular fourth in upstate New York can do. Oh, is it pronounced Castellia? I do not know. Castellia? Castellia, Castellia, either way, it's DDD and it's coming for you. Oh God, I hope it's not. I don't want DDD coming for me. I mean, I've been pronouncing it Castellia this entire day yeah. and he hasn't corrected me. I don't, I don't want DDD coming at all, man. Anyway. <laughs> no, neither do I. But we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna jump behind, we're gonna Gordo and we're gonna air dodge the ledge. And we're gonna land safely. There's a nair to no back here. Ooh, no, uh, you need to, you need a little bit more percent before getting that uh, those nair confirms. Up tilts, so many up tilts coming out from D, uh, from Falco. I mean, can't really blame him. That move leads to literally everything in his kit. There's the Gordo. The Gordo not getting reflected. Here's a forward tilt. Hammer is not going to connect. He just kind of needs to take those lasers. Like, he can't really do anything about it. He can jump over them, but then he has to land. Down throw, forward air. I'm shocked that was still true. Able to get my modern back off the stage. Trying to go for an up tilt. Okay, forward tilt just to poke the shield. Up tilt into back air is going to kill. Yeah, that's going to be enough. Okay, 87% now. Let's see if he can seal out the stock quickly or if, D uh, or if Falco is going to rack up a bunch of extra credit. Oh, drops down with the forward air going. Still hold center stage and punishes the laser with up smash. How do you get up smash out of shield? That's amazing. I don't know. He was so far away, too. Yeah, he, he he had a swing and he was able to get the hit. Oh, he got throw? the grab out of it, too. It, that, that was impressive. Yeah, up throw really only confirming at zero. So, not going to have a true up air there. Up air to fall down. Gonna g Oh, he had the right read, but he just, he just let it go a little bit too early. All right, back air. Oh, what else were you gonna expect from DD? How'd you still get hit by that? Hi. Is he dead? Might as well be after this. That's a crunch and a good recovery. Nice angle. Very good. I did not think that he could have gotten that. Uh, gotten that, but the slight angle on the up B is going to help him avoid the down air and get back. And now get a combo into back air. Not going to kill quite yet, but now here's the edge guard that DD has to worry about. Back air on a shield into F tilt. Ooh, just falls with the forward air. Up tilt! Oh my gosh! Castilia now taking the lead over iModders Falco. Two stocks to one, only 113% now. But iModders going uh, going to be trying to climb his way back up. Still 124 now. Let's see what the kill option is. We get back air, not quite going to do it. Up air to poke through the stage. No, yes! Oh, but he's going to get stage spiked by the down tilt. How'd, you, that go, move how'd you go that way? Uh, would, you, it, would, you, would you go that way? He was so far under the stage that that's, it just sent him directly up and it stage spiked him. It's just, it's just incredible that that's how it worked. That's so dumb. Yep. Grab. There's a grab. There's a forward air. A nair. It's dead. Okay. Yeah, I like the nair because it kind of... It's kind of like when you get hit by Ike's side B, it kind of forces you into, okay, well, I don't... This isn't a lot of hit stuns, so I don't really want to do anything yet. And, so I just charge another side B to catch you not jumping away. Jumping. There's the jump, there's the suck, there's the cuck. There's the gun. Uh, Kill smash. Oh, but just air dodges back. Very good for my modders. Here we go, the back air not going to quite connect. Up tilt, neutral air, not a very big combo, but one that sends him away. <laughs> that's so funny. You can reflect it, but Falcon can just reflect it by right back. Yeah, that's one of the worst reflectors in the game. It's just, it's going up against one of the best reflectors in the game. It's frame one. It is frame one. Okay, now let's see how he gets off the stage. Down air, just barely missed time. But DDD, the hardest character to kill off the top. It's going to take a little bit longer for that. But the back air is going to seal it. That was a good catch on the landing. I thought, you know, there might have been a little bit of a trade there. But that wasn't enough. Falco has the boots on today. And they are filled with lead. Yeah, uh, did, did they ever confirm, like, are they metal legs or are those just boots? They're pretty much metal legs. The weight, because like it's kind of like how the animals are just 
I don't want to say cyborgs, but they, they are definitely not putting their legs in boots. Okay, so those are those are mechanical legs? Those are fully mechanical, fully loaded, fully functional. Yeah, I remember there was a game theory on that, but that guy's never right about anything, so. Oh, really? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Okay, iModder's taking game one, but Castelia making that look like it's not a terrible matchup for DPD. Yeah, that was actually that was way, way closer than I thought it would be. Ooh, tries to catch the jump with the up air, but no, he's just going to cancel the momentum of his jump with side B. I guess, I guess when you're in New York and you have to fight a lot of these characters, you are going to be knowing the matchup. Yeah, you definitely are. But even even if you know the Falco matchup, he's still a terror of a character. Oh, barely misspacing the inhale and going to get sent off stage four at 90%. F tilts F tilts him to 98 and puts him back on the back off stage. Neutral air into forward air. Amazing the percent there. Down throw. Oh, going to get a drag down forward air, but no grab confirmed. We're gonna go back to stage. Trying to catch the up. Trying to catch with an up tilt. Didn't quite get it. Go looking for another one. Yeah, it's gonna probably kill at this percent. Okay, up tilt back air. No, not from center stage. Going high? No, I thought we were gonna land with the Gordo, but. I think he gonna... knocked the Gordo back into him? Oh, forward air hitting right below him. Yeah, that'll be good enough. Going in. There's the up tilt. We're gonna just stay in shield. Nothing to lose there. What's Falco gonna do? Grab you? Uh, certainly not. Oh, mistimes the back air. No lag, so luckily the grab came out. Oh, and just jumps onto that platform. Falco's double jump, the highest in the game. It really lets him recover into some of these because that side B, that up B is pretty bad for recovering. But with that double jump, he's able to fake out so easily. You're never quite sure, so you can't cover it like you can with Fox. And then he's got the wall jump too to match on, on top of that. That's gonna be enough. That's gonna be a kill off the side. Mm -hmm. There wasn't a whole lot he could have done about that. He either had to go to ledge or he had to risk it. He chose to risk it, didn't pay off. Let's see what he can still do with the stocks he has remaining. Oh, that was right there, but he just went into the Z-axis where the hammer was in the X and Y. Mm -hmm. Spot dodging right through and back throw. That's All not right. going to kill. Yeah, DDD does not have a kill throw. Oh, no. It's amazing. Rising there just did nothing. Yeah, it's it, it, it's pretty small. I get his shot. Oh, it's, so, it's such a bad hitbox. I remember seeing the comparison of that. All right, we gotta find this kill, but at least we're using our tools to our advantage by using lagless aerials, so you can just kind of keep pumping them out. There's a forward throw. Still not gonna get We're not at 200% yet, and we're gonna be living. Fire. Doesn't down tilt to try and catch that up tilt. Oh, but tries to dash away instead of shielding, and he is going to pay the price. Yeah, we're racking on too much percent now. You're at 70. I, I would try to get this kill ASAP. Anything will kill at this point. Yeah, but doesn't descend with the back air. Just gonna throw out an air to try and get himself some space. That's not gonna do it. Drag down fair into the down tilt into back air. 107 now. Oh, but no, iModder's not going to be able to get the kill and dies to a forward air. That's gonna be enough. At 200%, I would be surprised if forward air didn't kill anywhere from the stage. Don't air dodge. Ooh. Okay, didn't air dodge. And we got a off of it. Very good from Castelia there, just knowing that he cannot act first and then just lands with the neutral. He didn't even air dodge there. He just Mob just missed. Yeah, he just he just waited. All right, we're going back to the corner. We're gonna jump up. We're gonna suck himself up full of air. We're gonna die. Yeah, yeah. Just happens sometimes. It uh, does happen, and we hate it when it happens. But Falco in a really good spot. Let's see how we can close this out. Oh, the back air, that jump is gone. Forward air, and that's going to be an even game. 3.3% 3 3 separates these two players. DDD just going to retreat, fire off a of Gordo, but going to eat some lasers for his troubles. 17% now off of just stray damage. I can't I can't believe he, he was able to take him out in three hits just by edge guards. And they were meaty, they were huge, and he's dead for it. That's crazy. Yeah, three edge believe. guards and you're dead. That's Falco. Oh, doesn't get the drag down on the uh, on the neutral air, forced to send him away, but gets another grab and up throw back air. I, I guess it doesn't matter, because we're already back to the situation where we were before, we were at 100%. Oh, so but down throw? Oh, just going to go up to retreat. Come yeah, up I'll... with a reflector? No, come up with a neutral air. Get the weight off a ledge, there you go. That's all you can do. Just wait for Gordo to get messed up. There's the back air, there's the... Not that. Corner. There's the corner. Oh, 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 not the best either. Oh my goodness, I was not ready for that. But we still have another game here. Uh, definitely do not count Castalia out. He has he has shown his medal time and time again in this bracket, earning this spot in top eight. And I definitely wouldn't uh, uh, wouldn't be surprised if this doesn't end up being a 3-0. Go back. I don't back to town, right? I don't know. I don't know if I, I would go somewhere else. I would try to go a different place.
Yeah, I don't really think that the, the stage was really helping him at all. Like, it, it seemed like I Modder was completely on top of him, and the kill that he, uh, the like one early kill that he really did get, I was... guess that's gonna be enough to keep going back to the stage. Yeah, it wasn't really because of the stage, but uh, oh well. And I, I, I guess I guess it makes sense because then there's a lot of room for TDD to move around. It's not quite he's probably banning FD maybe or I I, I can't quite sh I can't quite tell, but this is gonna be enough to like have an open space. To, for DD to move and do everything he needs to do. Yeah, I definitely trust in Castelia. He knows why he's going to the stage. Okay, forward air, neutral air, just jumps uh, jumps out of it. DD's hitboxes, uh, they're big to start, but they kind of they kind of go away too quickly. Oh, that didn't even look like it hit him. It, it looked like it, that it hit Falco, but then I realized that the down air was able to take him out anyway. So we're at 125%. Up there now, 135 just descends with a weak hit neutral air, popping Falco right up, but only 39%. Gordo doesn't even get to hit it. There we go, air dodging back to ledge. Oh, there we go. Not going to be able to edge guard DDD yet again. There's a missed grab. There's a back air. I that am shocked that grab missed. Oh, oh, that's not what we wanted. We didn't want that. We did not want that at all. That platform, as you had said earlier, not helping out DDD in this stage at all. Grab. Down throw. No, no, going to get the forward air a little bit too far out of the percent. There it is. Back That's, air? That was meaty, but not meaty enough. Falco's going to be able to live a little bit longer, going all the way low. Oh, uh, just barely, but it doesn't matter. Gets the up tilt, and now he, I believe, has his first stock lead in a while. Game one, I know he had a stock lead for a brief time, but... I like that he's not shield grabbing. I like that he's waiting. You know, we saw the roll coming out, and Imodis just wanted that kill. We're waiting. We're waiting and we're reflecting. Yeah. This, this is all about a reflection match. What do I want to do here? Got a, got a lot of reflecting to do. Yeah, and right there he jumped out of shield, but shield was getting so small, I don't even think it would have saved him. That back here just coming for him when you're on the platform too long. Oh my you're just god. Forced to do an See, single laser is going to be able to send the spike ball back to DDD's demise. Going underneath the second laser. We're okay. Here comes the hammer. Here comes the sucking cuck. Oh, just barely missing the back air. We're going to be able to make it back to the center of the stage. That's one of the first times that's hit all set. Yeah, and even hit when he tried to go for the reflector. Does the down tail come out? Oh, no, it does uh, No, it does not. It does not hit him away. Double up air, 69% now. Uses the Gordo to protect his descent. Okay, let's see how he can keep him at this ledge. Forward tilt. Not going to get anything off of it. Yeah, yeah that's going to be enough. You can't re-grab ledge there. It Good thing he didn't try to go for the dash attack. That might have been too much lag. Just down till that's going to cover below the ledge anyway. I, I, I actually kind of feel like he could have held past ledge and gotten to the platform for that. But, eh. It's, yeah, it's totally possible, but brings it back anyway. Not too much of a deficit. Yeah, didn't air dodge, but he also missed the tack. So, my modder's just going to be able to get that landing back air, even up the game real quick. Yeah, DDD swinging at the air. That's what you hate to see. You want the quarter to come out. You don't want to have to make a funny motion with nothing in your hands. Oh, good, ju good jump catch. Caught him in the corner. That's a really bad spot to be. They had caught the roll, too. Uh, and now 96% on DDD right now. Falco, one up tilt at ledge away from sealing this. Up throw, up air. I, I like oh, the use no, of the command grab. Eye. DDD's almost dead. Oh, that was a back air, yeah. Okay, that oh, we hit back, back air. air. We're alive for a little bit longer, and we're in the air dodge. We air dodge into the blast zone, but the forward air is going to be enough to take it. 3-0 and a handshake. Yeah, that was, uh, okay, sorry, gotcha. that, that's really showing you why the matchup is so hard. Oh, DDD, that's garbage. Yeah, it, just DDD having so much trouble being able to play the game, getting back to a uh, spot where he can actually fight Falco on even footing. It's just, it's just so hard once you lose one interaction.